I'm Dr. Jamil Akhtar, a senior consultant, general laparoscopic surgery at Apollo Hospital, Greens Road, Chennai. Today, I'm going to talk about hernias. There are different types of hernias, namely epigastric hernia, ventral hernia, inguinal hernias, spigelian hernias, diaphragmatic hernia. I'm going to discuss about the inguinal hernias. The causes of the uh, hernias are namely chronic cough, smoking, constipation, heavy weight lifting, open appendicectomy and connective tissue disorders. So now coming to the inguinal hernias and what are the symptoms which the patient uh, presents with. There will be a swelling in the inguinal region whichever size it is right or left. The swelling first and foremost complaint is the swelling which gradually increases if it is left unnoticed. The swelling can increase from the inguinal region it can go into the scrotum. The next symptom would be a mild dull aching pain. The symptoms can vary from uh, simple pain to uh, severe pain. The severe pain happens when the inguinal, inguinal hernia comes goes into irreducibility or obstruction or strangulation. So the hernia has to be dealt on time because it can lead to multiple complications. First complications the hernia which can uh, which, which you can face is uh, of irreducibility. Irreducibility is something when the uh, whatever the lump you are feeling is not able, you are not able to reduce it. The hernia should reduce on its own. If it does not reduce, it becomes irreducible. The next step would be obstruction. If the part of intestine does not go in fully, it can go into obstruction, meaning that part of the bowel the food content will not go and that the remaining uh, part of the bowel will start distending it's called obstruction the next step would be strangulation the particular part of the bowel or the omentum will go into something called gangrene the blood supply to that particular part is hampered and it can go into gangrene hence a timely uh, repair of the hernia is warranted so what are the different um, uh, methods of uh, treating the hernia? The treatment of hernia is uh, can be done open, laparoscopic and robotic. Right now, uh, if you present early, the laparoscopic is that had become uh, has become a gold standard method of hernia treatment. If the patient presents at a later stage, when I mean, the large hernias, open procedures are uh, better than the laparoscopic procedure. Now how can you try to prevent the hernia? There are simple basic things. If hernia has to occur, it will happen. But you cannot uh, prevent from that because uh, some people, there is something called congenital hernia which is right from the birth which you go unnoticed and that gradually increases. But to prevent occurrence of hernia, you need to first and foremost would be stop smoking. Smoking is one of the most predisposing factor for the occurrence of hernia. Second would be avoid heavy weight lifting. You should uh, prevent yourself from heavy weight lifting because that increases the abdominal pressure and lead to a formation of hernia. So once the hernia surgery has been done, it's very important to do something called aftercare post-surgery. The most important parts are post-surgery you should not lift heavy weight. If you should stop smoking completely otherwise chance of recurrences are very high. Avoid constipation. If there's a cough, the get the uh, cough treatment done immediately. You should not squat. You should not lean forward. So these are the aftercare to prevent from hernia recurrence. Thank you.